Drink drivers are responsible for close to a quarter of all deaths on our roads. Now, a shock proposal to stop the carnage. The legal blood alcohol level could be cut from 0.05 to zero. It's um, a very um, significant uh, proposal. The police commission is calling for a national debate. There has been a trend in recent years for road rules and laws to be national so that there is consistency across Australia and personally I think that's a very good thing. As far as the Australian government is concerned, uh, we have uh, not taken a position when it comes to alcohol limits for driving. The controversial plan could limit numbers in places like this. The PA hospital was the scene today as the health minister unveiled a $50 million federal initiative to cope with disaster management. When a disaster strikes, it means that we can stick people on a plane immediately who will be familiar, who will work with, who will know that Darwin hospital backwards so they can get in there and just get stuck into treating patients healing the sick and injured. The PA Hospital will join with the Royal Darwin Hospital in becoming the front line for the treatment of disaster victims for the Oceanic region. The National Critical Care and Trauma Response Unit was set up in Darwin in the wake of the 2005 Bali bombings. Since then, it has aided in several crises, both at home and abroad. Nolan Giles, QT News.